Hey passengers, welcome back. We are in Washington, D.C. If you're a fan of comics, if you're a fan of D.C., if you're a fan of Marvel, if you're a fan of superheroes, this is the episode you've been waiting for. We are here at Awesome Con. It is going to be amazing. I got to see some people already in cosplay just outside. We're about to go inside the doors here. This is at the convention center at the uh, Washington uh, Convention Center inside of Washington, D.C. Got some noise. I got some awesome people walking past. Hey, Joe, roll that intro. Got Doc uh, original in the back. Are you going to see? Is he going to? Are you going to try to see if he'll sign up for you? Uh, well, I I am signed up for for Marty to sign this. Nice. Uh, we're not signed up with Christopher Lloyd, but we figured we'd see if maybe we could upgrade. Or, yeah. You know. That's awesome. Are you are you a uh, uh, Back to the Future fan yourself? Like yeah, all I'm of them. Him. Yeah, through <laughs> he him. He is now. I we love watched it. it on the way down in the van. Oh, awesome. Where, where's home at? Uh, New York. What uh, part of New York? Up near Saratoga. Okay, gotcha. Nice. Clifton Park. Awesome. Well, have fun here. I'm excited to get inside. I got to get my mask on. I'm ready to get inside. So, anyway. We're ready. What's your name? John Swain. John Swain. Oh, are you filming me? Yeah, if oh, you don't right care, is that. that okay? Check out my channel, Johnny Swain. There you go, on YouTube, yeah? <laughs> on YouTube, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. How about you? What's your name? Andrew. Andrew, great meeting y'all. Have fun, but you know, I mean, I see your shirt, so you're out of time, but you gotta get inside uh, before we run out of time. <laughs> right I on. hope he gets to sign that uh, guitar for you. Oh, absolutely. All right, be good. Thanks have fun. Time. Thanks. I have my QR code to get us into the uh, event itself. This is my first time I've ever been inside the convention center, and as you can expect, it's huge, so I don't know where I'm going, but follow along, we'll find our way. The variants are strong here. We've got not one, but we have both Spider here. Spider Man is these Delta variants. I'm telling you what. <laughs> Upstairs near the food court. We don't know where to go check in at. We're only here for one day We didn't buy the three day special or anything like that, but I'm telling you what some people here in cosplay It's amazing. Just to see them. I mean look One of the things that Joe was like, I bet we're gonna see Black Widow. I bet we're gonna see her sister. She's getting ready They're getting ready. We got Harley Quinn. We got Loki over here. I mean I could turn around We got a Game of Thrones character. We got Spider-Woman here. I mean, everybody is here today. We got the Spider-Man, the variants are here. Nice. Food and drink location here, the dining hall, in case uh, is set up for all the people that are enjoying today. They got coffee location here. You can purchase without having to stand in line um, and have somebody serve you. You can get a cup of Joe. Uh, not the Joe we know, but touch the start, pay there. Fill up your own cup of coffee. How cool is that? Third floor is the... Uh... You know, I think we've been inside this building for like 40 minutes already, just trying to get our badges, trying to get inside of the convention center to get to the exhibit hall. Um, did I say that wrong? Exhibit hall, I don't know what I said. Anyway, we're on our way, finally. There it is. This is what all of us have been waiting for. I don't know what's going on over here, but they've got food as well. 
The food courts are in here. It smells delicious. We haven't eaten yet. All right, no further ado. Let's get down there. Come on. First thing you walk on. All right. The National Science Foundation. Awesome. just getting started inside the exhibit hall and I'm already getting a little overwhelmed. I don't know where to go. I don't know what to see. I don't know what to do, but I want to see it all. I want to do it all. I'm not sure if you can see this, so you can get bacon cheeseburger with fries for $14.50. Cheeseburger with fries, $13. Fruityon burger with fries, $18. Chicken tenders with fries, $13. You can get just with french fries by themselves, $8.50. Assorted chips, $2.50. 32 ounce, 22 ounce for bottled water, assorted prices at the Burger Kitchen. So, I knew the prices here were going to be a little bit more high than I wanted to pay, but I didn't anticipate they're going to be, um, like Rodeo Drive prices. Just kidding. I mean, I'm willing to pay for it. I knew I could have gotten something on the outside. But um, a cheeseburger though, like a Beyond Burger, $18 with fries just seems really expensive to me. Um, just chicken tenders, 13 bucks, yeah. I could kind of see it, but it's, uh, we'll see what I get. I think I'm gonna do the chicken tenders. I was just told something that could save you a little bit of money when you go to some cons. So these cups here. Yes. Wild Bills. Wild Bills. Yep. And you said they're how much again? So for the initial cup, they have different types of cup, anywhere ranging between 15 and 30. However, when you go to future cons with this particular company in it, you do it's $5 refills for the entire day. That's just wonderful. And then there's other companies with very similar aspect. Yeah. And if you get those different cups, um, from different conventions that have the different things, you can get like $5 refills at those places. Nice. Yeah. yeah. That that right there is gold. Not just being that the cup is colored gold, but that right, that information is gold. Thank you very yeah. much. Yeah, we uh, we may have to end up doing that. Yeah. So these are really nice. They look it. They're, they're good for other drinks as well. I can, I can already imagine what I'd want to have in there. I can already see it, but for the $18 Beyond Burger, I can get that and enjoy my beverage of my choice. That's why we're not getting a drink, we're just getting the food. <laughs> I love it. The beverage of my choice is always what I do. But there's no alcohol in here, is there? I no, think there no, there's is. Beer. Oh, like uh -oh. Hiding. oh, they do have beverages of my choice here. Uh-oh. All right. What was your name? April. April. Hi, April. And your name? Hi, April and Adam. Nice meeting you. Yep. Thank you very much yes. for that information. No we will gladly press, uh, pass that on. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Love it. No, because um, it's going to be out of rotation. So for myself, I got the chicken tenders and Joe, it looks like he got himself a cheeseburger, a cheeseburger with fries. Take a look. Um, Let me smother it with ketchup. All up in his junk. Lunch is over. Yum. All right, we're ready to get back into this. Seems like we just got here and we wanted to eat. So that's what we did. We did also notice as we were sitting down, there's other places we could have eaten that too. We got Firehouse Sub and Taste of Asia over there as well. But our focus now is into the exhibit. Every single thing that makes you me and not him. He's in your past, I'm in your future. We got some entertainment just as we're walking. How cool. Chief is up here. You can get variants. Your variant shirt is here. I think that's Master Chief. 
Teeth over there. Master Teeth, yeah. yep. And there's our first Deadpool sighting. All right. Out of all the characters that are uh, here today, we found our first Deadpool. How many more do you, I think I'm going to find? I think we'll see at least five more. At least. The Matrix. But um, that's kind of long. Let's see if we can find more. Like I said, we got one right there. And we do have a Disney character here. We do have a, we've got Buzz Lightyear and Woody. There's so many merchandise items you can purchase that I don't know why you would need to wear it outside of cosplay unless you like it. But anyway, so this comes from deliciousboutique.com. We got Superman over here. The difference with this Superman and all the others is this one actually looks like he has real muscles. Take a look. A Superman with real muscles, they do exist. No, oh, this isn't real. Those aren't real? Nah. Oh. Now I'm, I'm too I'm too too tan underneath, but uh -huh. this just makes you look more super. It really looks it though. That's well, thank awesome. Thank you. That's thank awesome. you very much. Nice. Normally just women lie to me, but I appreciate no, it. No, no. I mean I, <laughs> I I got fooled. I got fooled. Maybe I can get me a suit that looks look skinny. <laughs> Have fun. Yeah, too fun. Thanks. That's cool. This uh, I don't know if you're able to see it, the chest harness and everything he wore was was fake. What I'm already finding is that if you're looking for some t-shirts, if you're looking for some uh, something that is one of your favorite things, such as uh, Harry Potter, or if you're into um, something in the anime, they're gonna have the merchandise here for you to purchase. Yes, I knew that coming into it, but look at this table. If I can get back over there, we got t-shirts, $23 uh, each. We got a Hufflepuff to my left. We've got uh, $23 for two for 42. They've got a lot of options here. Look at that. Happy Trees University. How cool. Oh, oh Grogu. <laughs> and yeah, they got a lot of shirts. So there you go. It's back to the future. In my parents' basement.com. Come see us. What's the name of it? In my parents' basement. In my parents' basement.com. Yeah. Right. Oh my. That's catchy. That's something you can remember too. In my parents' basement. That's where it all happens. Dot com. Yeah. Right. Do you silk screen these or do you? No, they're, 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 they're not. They are licensed t-shirts. Okay. Yes. Awesome. Cool. We have the best prices, the best selections. So okay. Come see us. Thank you very much. Well, there you go. You've been told they got the best prices. In my parents' basement. Dot com. Sweet. <laughs> awesome. Once again, we are here at Awesome Con 2021, Washington, D.C. This event did not take place last year or the year prior, as I'm told. Um, I'll have to look into that one a little bit more, but I do believe this has been a two year hiatus. This is the first time back. And as I'm walking around, all this merchandise you can purchase, I think the first thing I keep thinking of is Spencer Gifts. This is a huge Spencer gift shop that you see in one of the malls. All these paintings and drawings of such, and you can purchase the prints. Prints for one for 20 or two for 30. Pretty cool. Oh, Grogu. Comic Con. <laughs> Yep. Alright, if you got pics with them, share them with Trick Leaf Studio. Hashtag. Hashtag. Trick Leaf Studio. There. Look how cute. <laughs> the website for the client. I'll send it. Yeah, so Joe was just asking how much this Grogu is. And he was just told it's $60, six zero. Sketch Cartel.
It's just waiting. I know. So it's... I purchased a Grogu. Oh, big Grogu. Fan of Grogu. And I uh, always like adding, you know, buying desk toys for the desk at work. Yeah. In the studio. In the studio. I'm not sure if you're able to hear what Joe was saying, but basically what he's saying is like heathens. People will want something so bad that they are, um, they're just in involved uh, in themselves. They're not necessarily paying attention to you, so make sure you pay attention at any of these places. Be safe out there, folks. All right, look at all this. I'm in some good light right now. Um, not even my own. <laughs> Look at that. That's more than meets the eye right there. Oh, awesome. Tony, stop. All right, so we're up in one level, trying to figure out um, what's next. Where do we want to go? We didn't purchase any of the autograph sessions. We didn't purchase any of the add-ons. We're just here to see what's going on. But one thing that um, a lot of the fans are here to see is Michael J. Fox and also Christopher Lloyd. Both of them are here signing autographs and doing the meet and greets um, on, as, with the panel. Uh, it'd be really cool to see Michael J. Fox, but if you see a little bit of Back to, or if you see a lot of, I should say, of the Back to the Future uh, t-shirts or other things guitars they're here to see michael j fox and christopher lloyd in regards to that they got the delorean here as well um they've also got a few more uh guest appearances but i'm trying to remember who they are and i forget at the moment but oh my gosh what is this what is this I'm trying to step on out step on oh how cool hi. is this hi 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 i like cereal oh <laughs> i love it <laughs> so cool Thank you. <laughs> oh, wow. That looks awesome. I love it. I love it. You look wonderful. <laughs> okay, at, the, at the end of the day, it's either far this way or far this way. <laughs> We've been that way. We didn't see any. So it's this way. It's gotta be. If you find the DeLorean, it's right next to there. Because it looks like there's a DeLorean photo on right by the street. Right, 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 right. But I don't... Still, wherever that is. So... Oh, oh that's... Right there so is aisle 2100. And that's 1900. So there you go. It's going to be down that way. All right, cool. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Have fun. There we go. Yeah, let's go see the DeLorean. Looking good. <laughs> Come on, folks. How are you? I'm walking and talking. Awesome. It's <laughs> artistry at, at, at its finest. Thank you. Yeah, thank it looks you. nice. Yeah, so you can see with all of these, I, uh, I yeah. take them out to the gun range and I shoot them. Nice. Or uh, smash them up with a hammer. Like it. Yeah, so these are all 9 mil rounds. Okay. That I use. Uh, the jumper piece up here, those were uh, 12 gauge slugs from a shotgun. Gotcha. And the video stuff. Look, you get to have a lot of fun while you're doing it. <laughs> You would think so, but it's nerve-wracking. Oh, yeah. You mess up, it's then, over. uh... Yeah. Yeah, because uh, the first thing I do is, uh... <laughs> I have to create the glass. I have to create a glass that doesn't completely explode. Right. And then I uh, finger paint the acrylics oh, on really? here. Yes, sir. And then use a razor blade to carve my... Oh, image. my goodness. Then, uh, yeah, the final piece is taking it out to the range and shooting it. Wow. Wherever 
did you think of doing this at? I was at a uh, shooting competition, yeah. and there was a uh, car windshield okay. that had just been shot to hell. But it had the most beautiful spirals, spider webs, yeah. splinters, and I was like, I have to learn how to create that nice. without completely like exploding the glass. Awesome. Yeah, so it took a lot of time before I was able to kind of create my own version of a, a strong glass that's strong enough, but yeah. also weak enough. Okay. Well, it's really neat. I mean, I definitely wanted to stop and see what you were doing because hey, you. I was intrigued and I like it. Awesome. Thanks. So, and if anybody wanted to find you, we can get Jay Saunders here. Let's see if you want to go. There you go. There's a panther here. Pretty, pretty good. Awesome. Thank you. And that's the Black Panther Benjamin up beside me. Looks like we got Ursula passing by. Love it. heaven I can't lie this is so cool to see all this stuff I got to see the R2 unit here having a great time we got a <laughs> Bubba Fett walking by we've got other uh, droids we got BB-8 in the background other droids here going to go I'm just in heaven I got uh, this is so cool yes BB-8 yes tell me talk to me are these the droids we were looking for but this goes for a really good cause. This goes towards uh, cats and dogs rescuing. You've got Copeland, you got Floyd over here. Uh, you know, they've also got Ollie, and this is also with the 501st. If anybody knows anything about Stormtroopers, and if they know anything about Star Wars and cosplay, the 501st is amazing. It's worldwide. I've met a couple people out of Australia. I've also have a really good friend. Hey, Mike. Um, he's with the 501st. Anyway, let's go. We got more things to do. Come on. I like his shirt, the best father in the galaxy. Yes, it's a great shirt. All right, you can sit here and watch uh, some Starfleet. If you're a fan of Star... All right, I'm just noticing, but they got Star Wars, Star Trek stuff. But nobody's fighting. Believe it or not, nobody's fighting. All right, All right we're going to get a, um, the Wild Bill. We're gonna get one of the mugs. You purchase it today, and anytime you see Wild Bills, you can get a refill for only five bucks. They got different flavors. I'm um, looking over here. It looks like they've got a uh, Rocky Mountain root beer. They've got a grape flavor. They got other flavors I can't get to real quick, but um, I'm just in line with it to come up. Now, 
one thing about this place I really do like, I've noticed there's a sign that reads that this is a uh, veteran owned and operated um, uh, soda sh shop, you know, uh, startup. But they're also part of the, um, what was it? Let me see, the, the Warrior uh, Reunion uh, Foundation. So that's on the side of the shirt. Anyway, these are the shirts. These are the guys that are working here. So Warrior Reunion Foundation. We got other people here just waiting. I don't know how this is going to work. Don't know how much it's going to cost. I see that they've got two different, um, you can get one's a barrel, the other's a double barrel. They show somebody, that's got, he's got something good right there, I hear it. So we can buy the mug, get unlimited refills. Unlimited refills. refills. Okay. And then you take the mug to any other show we do, you pay $5 to get unlimited refills that day. Perfect. Yeah. So today is unlimited refills. Unlimited refills. Beautiful. Yeah. And I see this is a veteran owned and operated. So perfect. I'm retired military, so I appreciate it. Thank what you very service? much. Army. Uh, so so we got a West Point guy here. Perfect. Yep, I'm Navy. Okay. We have, uh, if he's an officer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's mo mostly, we have mostly. Right? Yeah. Right? I mean, right? it's right? just, it's kind of the thing we do. We still love you. Don't get us wrong. Yeah, so when we, uh, when veterans come, we give them a, a pass for free refills the whole event. Oh, wow. That's our veteran nice. program today. Nice. That's pretty neat. I mean, I, I got a YouTube channel and I saw that the sign is uh, obstructed just a little bit, but once you know that sign, it's yeah, 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 always yeah. part of it. So it's awesome. So, all right. Well, just in a minute, I'm gonna get my mug. Yay! <laughs> How much are the mugs? So they start at thirty-five dollars. Okay. Forty, forty-five, and fifty. Okay. These are double barrel insulated, and okay. these are single. Okay. I'll show you the difference. Put them in your. All righty. That's, that's not it. too heavy. No, there's that one. Oh, that one feels like some uh, some good weight to that one. Yeah. Nice. And it'll last forever. It's stainless steel. Perfect. Don't put it in the dishwasher. Okay. And wash it. Um, and we'll see. We, we do like. 400 events across the country. Wow. There's a bunch in this area. So. Okay. We'll have to definitely know about it. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll bring you up to uh, meet Tim here. Perfect. I feel like I'm somebody special. I'm being brought up specifically yeah. to meet Tim. Well, <laughs> so, Tim, we have yep. a veteran here, so he gets a gold band. Oh, wow. Cool. Thank you very much. Yeah. Appreciate it. MP. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you for your service. Thank you. Thank you for yours. All right, so I kept seeing everybody have these mugs. And monkey see, monkey do, and yes, I had to have it. So I got the black cherry. Um, they got all these different flavors. I, got, I think you're able to see them. So I'll hit them up in a little bit. Uh, there's no beverages of my choice today, so I made a new choice, and it was a pricey one, but I get to keep the mug. And if I go to any other places, they said they had 40 some others that they do of the year. Um, I'd have to look at the video to remember how many specifically. But with that, uh, just try to remember to bring my mug if I go to other places. There's so much to do and see that we don't know what to do or what to see. We got Princess Leia here protecting the planet and all the kitties and dogs as well. We've got other costume cosplay folk. Oh, look, 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 this is hilarious. Enjoy the moment. This is when it becomes worthy again. Yes. And no, he's made me <laughs> Come on, man. I'm disappointed, you, brother. Listen to the fury. He is quite vocal. Oh, no, wait, what? I, I got it. <laughs> I still have <laughs> Okay, that's arrived. I can't be on air. It's not to keep you worthy. But it's okay, you have both hands full. You need the fury of me. Come on! Oh, oh. That's a variant. For all time. For all time. Always. <laughs> all right. Now, when I walked in here, I said I thought I was going to see five different um, uh, Deadpools. I've only seen one so far. But look at these two. Look how cute they look together. You guys look great together. Thanks. Nice. So just because you're disabled and you need a hover around or something to get around, take a look at this one. See? 
do something fun. If you got it, roll with it. Get it? Roll with it? That's so cool. This is my first Comic Con convention I've ever been to. I've always wanted to go, I've never been able to do it. Um, this was last minute, so I didn't do a lot of research, but they do have panelists here, and you can pay to get some of the people's uh, autographs or a photo op with them or whatnot. Joe's gonna find out a little bit more information. We're not going to do it today. George Takei, or Takai, however you pronounce his name, he's here, he's uh, doing autographs. So is William Shatner. Oddly, I didn't think they liked each other, so um, it's kind of interesting. That must have just been an internet rumor. Anyway, so they got uh, Christina Ricci. Uh, she is here signing autographs. Um, Christopher Lloyd selling is uh, doing autographs as well. Michael J. Fox, supposed to, but we don't see his spot. They've asked us, please don't take um, uh, video into the area. You know, they're there to make some money too for whatever charities or whatever reasoning that they're doing it. I get it, you know, totally get it. To respect your, their boundaries. Um, I don't want to get kicked out today. If you ever do come to a Comic Con, um, this is the panels, like for this one here specifically, this building is huge. This is what they've got going on. So George is over here, you can't see him. Christina Ricci is the side, William Shatner, and it goes on and it goes on and it goes on. So it looks like the star of this Comic Con, the awesome con in Washington, D.C., is Michael J. Fox. And with that being said, the prices vary. You can get just the autograph for $225. For $275, you can get a premium package, which comes with, um, a, what does the 275 come with? So the standard is just the picture. The next one up, you can bring in like comic books, any of the items from any of his movies, we'll sign them. Um, and then there's like all sorts of comic books. Um, um, I can't think of everything. The, the like highest one you can do is like Pepsi bottles and things like that. But I think the hoverboard was, I think it was either the second highest or the top tier. I just don't remember which yeah. one it was. So yeah, you heard that. So you're paying like almost $300 for him to sign a hoverboard. Not give you a hoverboard but him to sign it anyway so they've got this set up here for him and back in back yonder it wraps around um and that's where he's going to sit to do all that stuff at so we're going to spend 200 some odd dollars to see michael j fox not today not today you know um yeah he's pretty cool i'm glad that uh i got to grow up with him um on tv but i'm not paying 270 bucks or 200 bucks let alone just to see him for a quick second all right so i just ran into brian he's one of the neighbors he's the one who told me that this was going on last night he told me last night that this was happening and we're talking right now about the panelists um william shatner and george takai is that how you pronounce it is it takai takai um sorry george i don't i'm saying it wrong but he started talking about that they were feuding as well i just mentioned it to y'all that they I was surprised that they were in the, um, the same building. He said the exact same thing. So is the feud still going on between them? Because they're... It's questionable. Yeah, has to be. Yeah. Was it all just for TV? No. Was it all just for the internet? Mm. Something yeah. bad Something. happened. Yeah, definitely. I wonder. Anyway, inquiring minds want to know. Let us know in the comments below, would you? Thanks. <laughs> William Shatner is right back there. He's leaving, he's standing, he's leaving. The captain is leaving. He is done for the day. The captain is gone. He's up the building. They got Carl Withers here, Billy Boyd. We've got uh, Adam, is that Adam Savage? Oh, from uh, Mythbusters? I think so. We wanted to know the prices, and here they are. All right. The Deadpool count is at two. He looks like Robin, but he's Deadpool. Out of every person that's in cosplay, um, they look like they're having an amazing time, first and foremost. But, you know, I, thought I see a ton of Deadpool. So far, I've seen two. I cannot count how many um, variants of Loki I've seen, though. Seems like they're all over the place. 
You've got uh, the Loki for President one, was pretty awesome. I think that guy's costume was definitely on point. Uh, you've got uh, um, just in his jumpsuit, you got him as old Loki, you got him as new Loki, but Loki definitely is the most popular, uh, definitely the most popular character that I've seen. Sorry, I gotta keep looking left and right because I don't know where I'm going. I'm just walking. Joe just came over to me. He's like, hey, you've got to come see this. And um, I think I've seen this somewhere before. I know I've seen it online somewhere. Look at some of these. I would have known to come to a comic con uh, to get a tattoo but yes I love tattoos I want another I need more <laughs> I think I've seen everything now we have a Pikachu Deadpool with the tail this is awesome that is the coolest <laughs> Hey Joe, yeah. there's something strange in the neighborhood. Who are you gonna call? call oh, the Ghostbusters! <laughs> what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up? That's so cool! Oh. I'm just thinking to myself, how many different people have different, are wearing costumes here? How many are in cosplay? And then I start looking a little further there's so much originality that's walking around. It's really neat. You know, we've got uh, John Candy's character back here. That's so cool to see. Um, just anywhere you turn, you're going to see somebody else walking around. We've got, looks like, uh, is it Princess Leia over there? Keep going this way. Stitches Oh my goodness. Here's your Ghostbusters right there. Sully. And here's your. Hello guys. Awesome. Hello there. Hey. Hello, hello. So do you are you the artist? Or yeah, not? I draw all these. I'm not the artist of Stitch. That's right. Chris Sanders. Right. But I, I do other projects for Disney Channel and Disney Plus. Oh cool. Yeah. Nice. He says he's currently working on a new one. It's like a developer. Okay. Yeah. And how cool is that? Isn't that fun? So I see you sell these, and if somebody wanted to purchase, how do they get a hold of you to purchase? Uh, I have a website, stitchtunes.com. Okay. Or look for me under Stitch Tunes on Etsy. Okay. Yep. Nice. And I sell a bunch in person too. I'm all over the country. Perfect. All right. Sorry, 
fucking hell. He's Roger's all, just like, nobody wants me. It's all about the robots. Hi, huh, Roger. How are you? Hello, hello. Oh. <laughs> And are you Jessica? I am. We got Jessica as well. How beautiful. Oh, you all so cute. Love it. So Halloween is not that far away. About a month and a half or so away. And I predict right now that you're going to see more Loki variants uh, for dressed up as Halloween this year than any other costume. <laughs> um, like four over there, and then there's like another four back that way. this room conference room they've turned this into a gaming platform area so you can come in and play different games no matter what your skill level is come in play make a friend is what it right on the outside take a look
give it to sure. me? No, I'm good. Thank you. Thank you very much. I like what they've done with the Xboxes and the consoles. <laughs> Had to lock them down, make sure nobody steals them. You guys look so good. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey folks, if you like this video and others like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're having a great time making these, but we are out of time. If you get it, get it, you got it. All right, we'll see you next time, okay? Follow along, tell your friends about us, hit that bell for future notifications. Also, like, share, please. All right, we'll see you soon, okay? Bye.